Arts in the Heart is Augusta's oldest and largest festival. We're in our 29th year, and it's a celebration of all that is good in Augusta, of the cultural diversity, of the amazing arts community, and the wonderful people. I think it's a real fun thing, and it's kind of a trademark for the city, because when you talk of Augusta, you know, this is one thing which everybody uh, looks forward to. It has stuff for the kids to do, it has stuff for me to buy, and it has great food for us to eat, so it's fantastic. The best thing about art in the heart is the art itself. <laughs> I think it's great. There seems to be a lot of variety of artists and um, a lot of food that looks really good. Hopefully we'll get some later. Oh, the food. Love the food. It's not just grown-up stuff that's here. It's really good for kids, too, because then it can get them into having fun at, like, a sort of smaller version of a fair. This is one place where, you know, you get to uh, see people of different cultures, their cultural activities, the kind of food they eat, and uh, many a times, you know, uh, the kind of dresses they wear. So it's really fun, you know, to come around and uh, see the cultural, you know, uh, full of people of different places and countries here. Arts in the Heart really is an experience that you, you can't duplicate anywhere else. It is a trip around the world in the culinary village. It is over 130 fine arts and crafters. It's four stages of nonstop entertainment, a free hands-on children's area, a literary village, something for everyone. The entertainment changes every 30 minutes, something different, something for older people, something for youth, something for kids. We plan it so the whole community can walk in here, see something maybe they haven't seen before, but also see themselves on every stage.